Hey everybody, Let's sneak this one in on you. Um, upon reviewing the videos on my phone before uploading them, I noticed there were eight mysterious photos on my phone that I didn't take. Um, Y'all know I don't take photos out there. I don't. I do video only. I review the video in quarter speed, take screenshots, and it seems to be the, the best way to find them. Um, these photos are interesting for the order they're in on my phone. Um, they're in between Fletch's area and Mercy's area. So the Fletch video, eight photos, and then Mercy video. But they're all of Mercy's area. So how did those photos get on my phone before I even did the Mercy video? So, since I don't have a way of doing like a slideshow kind of thing and getting it up on my uh, channel, what I'm going to do is I'm going to send them off to Lewis, North County Bigfoot, and he was going to post them to the Bigfoot Research Evidence Group on Facebook. Um, y'all can go check them out there. Let me know what you think. Um, I've already reviewed them. Um, I've sent them off to a couple of people and they circled exactly the same thing I'm seeing. And, uh, it, it's interesting they were they were waiting for the bucket to get filled so um when i do a video it puts that video in a file in my gallery for today it literally says today yesterday says yesterday after that it has a date um, so do a video, it gets put in for today, do another video and it gets put on the left side of that past video and so on and so forth. So along with these photos, I will be sending to Lewis to put on the research, uh, Bigfoot research evidence group on Facebook. I'm going to include a screenshot of what my photo gallery looks like when you go into it and uh you'll see it says today um there's two rows of pictures now on the bottom row on the right side all the way at the end that will be my intro video i did at my truck i've already uploaded that um in the bottom left hand corner of anything that's a video you will see a little round circle with a play emblem in it and in the bottom right hand corner of that same picture it'll have a timestamp and that tells you how long that video is anything that doesn't have that is a photo so you can see i did the intro video i did another video of something interesting i found on the way up I did Fletch's video. You'll have eight photos. Mercy's video. And then you'll see a screenshot of my photo gallery page, what it looks like. And, um, very weird. 
very weird. It's not the first time I've had odd photos pop up on my phone. Um, Y'all remember a couple weeks ago I couldn't upload those two videos. Bama Bigfoot caught that quick flash walking into Fletch's area. Now, the, vi the intro video before those two videos uploaded fine. Those two videos would not upload at all. Not from my phone. And then the videos I did after that uploaded fine. Just fine. Um, I literally had to load them onto my laptop and uh, get them onto my channel through the laptop. So whatever affected those videos affected the phone. Not so much the videos, but affected the phone. Because the videos uploaded onto the laptop just fine. And then they uploaded to YouTube just fine through the laptop. But they wouldn't upload through my phone like I normally do. Um, so... Pretty odd stuff. So I'll get those photos sent off to Lewis, North County Bigfoot. And he is going to post them to the Bigfoot Research Evidence Group on Facebook. And go check them out. Let me know what you think. Um, you want to contact me directly, you can always email me. SoCal Forest Ninjas at gmail.com or if you don't mind the uh, the slow boat reply you can always email me at socalforestninjas at hotmail.com and uh, get in touch let me know what you think of those photos so be on the lookout for those on the Bigfoot Research Evidence Group on Facebook pretty interesting so, alright everybody, I'll see you later.